What is going on guys? Grave here. Today we got the announcement there will be a PlayStation State of Play tomorrow, March the 9th. This will be for PS4 and PS5. This will start March the 9th at 2 p.m. Pacific, 5 p.m. Eastern, and 11 p.m. CET. Of course, you can watch this on Twitch or YouTube. They said the show should you know, last around 20 minutes, give or take. They're going to talk about a lot of different things uh, within this uh, PlayStation State of Play. They're going to talk about some stuff from the VR2 titles, have some hardware to show off during the broadcast. They're going to have some of the developers there talking about different games. They also said they're going to be showcasing new reveals and eye-catching updates for the PS4 and PS5. Now, we did have an update for PlayStation today. This is one of those small updates that has no patch notes. It's kind of those background UI fixes is all, you know, PlayStation ever talks about what's within some of these updates. But I did make a video about three weeks ago talking about the big update that was coming kind of down the line. I will pop that up in the top corner right now if you have not seen that. But that's going to be a lot of changes to the PS4 and PS5. A lot of UI changes, a lot of changes to the new party system that a lot of people do not like. So they're going to kind of revert that back to some of the older uh, party system ways, the, the party system we all really enjoy. They're also going to take some things from the PS5 and add it to the PS4 dashboard and party system. But like I said, if you haven't checked out that video, it's up in the top corner. You can give that a look. It sounds like we might get some reveals of some other games. I'm hoping it's not going to be just VR2 stuff. I know a lot of people out there love you know VR games, but at the same time, I know a lot of people out there are really wanting to see some stuff from some new PlayStation games. Now, of course, we did get the new Horizon game not, that came out not long ago, but I know there's a lot of other games people are looking forward to as well. You know, maybe some more gameplay, maybe a, a release date for some of these uh, PlayStation exclusive titles uh, that we haven't heard of yet. I would, I'm, I'm kind of hoping they keep up with the state, uh, the state of play. I think it's always a good thing when uh, Sony does this to kind of give us an idea of what's going on in general with all the changes and updates coming to both platforms. But at the same time, it kind of gives an idea of how, uh, you know, or how or what exactly they're working on for the future. And maybe they'll even give us an update. I'm not sure if they will own PlayStation's kind of stock in general. Uh, I think a lot of these companies are, are still working on getting stock back in place. I know a lot of you out there still don't have a PS5. It took me around a year to get one myself uh, before I could finally find one at retail price. And I know it's been a pain for a lot of people. And I'm hoping they're going to start including some stuff about you know, stock shortages and exactly what they're doing to fix that because we don't really hear a lot from these companies when it comes from Sony or from Microsoft, either one. They'll kind of just be hit and miss with information. But I'm really hoping that we get to see some information about that along with some really good titles for both platforms because it seems like they're still working on stuff for PS4. I'm not sure if that's just because they know of the stock shortages for the PS5, so they feel like they have to keep continuously, you know, producing things for the PS4 until everyone that wants a new PlayStation can get one. We'll kind of have to wait and see what all is talked about in tomorrow's State of Play. But just keep in mind, if you're a person that likes to watch the State of Play, that will be out tomorrow, March the 9th. Of course, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. If you liked the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.